Hey, how's it going, guys? Captain Cubic here, and welcome to this uh, live stream of Prince of Persia, The Lost Crown. This is a game that I've been dying to play for a long time. I played the demo like a couple of days ago, and the moment I played it, I'm like, I need to buy this game. I knew that this was the game for me. I don't even know if, like, have I done, like, all the setups and stuff? Like, just the language and all that? Anyway, we're going to be playing Prince of Persia, Lost Crown. Uh, let me go to this, uh, the chat real quick. Pop out chat. This is going to be, I'm hoping this is more of a chill stream, even though I just realized I do have the Aphrodite moan thing. <laughs> I don't know how to take it off. Whoa, what did I say? What did I say? I don't even know what that said. But I don't know if, have you guys played this game here in the chat? I, I see some people who just are in it for the platforming only. Uh, someone said, wait, wait, wait I, I saw the comment. Beware the time trials. Not really a spoiler since previous Prince of Persia games had time trials beware i'm guessing they are like the super hard levels like in crash bandicoot like i in platforming i love those levels that are just platform heavy like just nothing but platform let's see let's see where we at hey soldier studios how you doing man um but at, if you notice i didn't even name this uh this video like part one i'm not I'm not going to force myself to do a playthrough of this. I'm just going to play it whenever I want. Sometimes I'll stream it. Sometimes I'll just play it by myself. I'm just, I'm here to enjoy this thing. Because it just, it looks so good. I love the mythological setting. I, I don't know if I love Sargon yet. Like, I'm going to have to listen to the story a little bit more. But what, what is this? Exploration. Explore the world with minimal map information. Choose this mode to discover the world for yourself. Map icon displays the location of next objective. Available and blocked path are marked. Choose this mode for easier navigation. I feel like I should go with this. This is I'm I'm all for like video game challenges and all that, but when it comes to <laughs> finding my way through maps, that is like the biggest hurdle I have. So this one I don't I think I'm gonna go with this, even though I'm afraid it's gonna be full of freaking icons in the map, which I also hate. And I think what difficulty do you guys recommend? <laughs> So I'm a little bit nasally because I woke up, I woke up like two hours ago and I'm like, I'm going to set the stream like later, like at two hours from now. So I'm not as nasally, but it's, it's, I'm still nasally. I'm sorry. With some challenges on your path, this is the extended difficulty for the game. Athra depletion rate. Okay. So this is only, okay. Not going to lie, 2D God of War would be cool. Based on the demo I played of this game, like this, oh man, that theme. That's pretty good. <laughs> I think I heard it in the demo as well. Uh, this is what God of War Betrayal should have been, man. And I, I hope... I don't know. I hope we have, we'll, ever get, we'll, have, we'll get one eventually. I feel like I'm going to go with Hero. I might regret that. I hope I can change it halfway through. We're getting a cutscene right away? Oh, we are. Okay. 30 years had passed. Decades without rain. The once fertile plains of Fars had become as barren as the loot salt desert. Let me know if I need to adjust the audio, by the way. From Persepolis, the Kushans, bloodthirsty warriors from the east, were attacking Persia. Persian soldiers defended the land. No matter the cost. Ardashir resisted heroically, but his men fell one by one. Anahita summoned her remaining strength in battle. For you, Vishka, the Kushan general, victory was certain. I wonder if the Kushan is an actual... History took a different turn. The seven immortals were the best warriors in the kingdom. <laughs> this reminds me of the Kung Fu Panda <laughs> intro a little bit. One of them would become a legend. Uh, 
Alright, does anyone know if the Kushan... Because I actually got a book, like, in preparation for this game. I didn't listen to it all the way, but I got a... I've... It's this, the Shamahe, like, the Book of Kings, is that what it's called in Persian? The Shamahe, I think? Uh, it's a pretty interesting, like, audiobook. It's very well acted, like, it's a radio, radio drama thing, and I really like it. But I haven't really gone to it through completely. Is the Kushan a people mentioned in that book? Like, is that is it an actual historical group of people? I don't know. Now, pretty sure it requires an account. Wait, what do you want to do? Okay. Persian mythology is... Yeah. Persian mythology is very rich and magnificent. Magnif I can't speak. I just woke up, okay? Magnificent, Cuba. You should explore more of it. No, I'm reading the book. I'm on it, okay? Kushans were actually a civilization. They got conquered by... As S Sassanids? S I don't know. Persians in real life. Okay, so they are... They are real people. Okay. All right. Let me know if the audio is okay. Onward, immortals. Who's that? Is he hurt? Anahita. That's Anahita? Don't worry about me. I'll be fine. Save Persepolis. I trained you for this. I'm, I'm, I'm exclaiming because, like, she was mentioned in the... In the demo. I'm like, I, I would imagine she'd look more mighty, but it's fine. I okay. Go help my wounded warriors. Okay. Let's go, Let's see if I remember. Uh, <laughs> why is he moon? What was? Why was he moon walking? That you guys saw that? That was pretty funny. All right. Let's see. Oh, you run like this? Yeah, yeah. Okay, I remember. I'm gonna have to remember all the combos and shit. When's part three of the God of War Norse run coming up? I don't know. I'm playing Prince of Persia now. Okay. Oh wait. Oh, I can't dash now. Oh. I like this intro so far. Like, I really would not mind a 2D God of War game. Like, if if God of War Betrayals was, was like this, it would have been so good. But I get it, it's a phone, phone game. Kind of sad gaming is uh, going this way. Well, Ubisoft at least, especially when they say stuff like, get used to not owning your games. What do you mean, Steven? What do you mean? What do you mean the direction? Oh, I mean like, they don't want to have physical games anymore. It's almost a given these days that, yeah, physical games are a thing of the past. Even me who used to... What is this? Okay. It glows. Come on, game. It glows. I'm... I would imagine it would do something. But uh, even me who li likes to own a physical library of games, I'm more okay these days with just like getting it digitally. It's like, ah, who cares? You know, like... <laughs> Oh, nice! Okay, hold on. How did I do that? It's gonna be like a combo. How did I even do that? It's not that. I don't know. None of you will leave here alive. <laughs> okay, Perry. I did it again! What kind of weapon is that? What kind of cool? The 2020 game. My thing, my main thing is actually owning the games. I don't want to rely on companies putting all the games on clouds. Oh yeah, I don't like that either. I even had like a Xbox Game Pass for a while, it, and it sort of just cheapens the experience. I can't really explain it. It's like, eh, it just feels too much like Netflix. Like I, I like, I feel like I, I'm better if I own the games, you know. But I feel like that's that's where we're going in the future. Oh. Oh shit. Oh, oh crap, you scared me, man, Elias. Oh, I didn't see these guys. I'm too busy looking at the background and stuff. 
I need to figure out how, to, how he's doing that spinning thing. Hope I'm playing on, on hard. I'm not playing on normal. What's the difficulty? Uh, it's not hero? I forget what it was. It's the one above normal, I'm pretty sure. So I guess it's hard, yeah. yeah I mean, I played a demo and I thought it was pretty good. I, I, I didn't think I would need to be on normal. I'm like, I can handle these games. Maybe, maybe I'll live to regret that. Game Pass, <laughs> Game Pass does feel like you have a lot of game trials. It, it's true, yeah. What did he do? That spinny kick, huh? How did I? That, because there's like two. Okay, two kicks. Okay, when you slide, there's this one, which just brings them up, and then. Ah, nice, nice, nice. Uh, more connect hack and slash. Wait. I more connect hack and slash identity to Devil May Cry. Definitely not God of War, especially after the reboot. I mean, especially after the reboot, sure. But God of War was hack and slash. What do we got here? Oh, wait, wait. Okay, re Reckless attacks yellow. Yellow eye represents a special opportunity to parry. To trigger. Ah, that's how it works. So yellow gives you cool cutscene. Gotcha. give him oh okay I don't know if I should have done that Yaviska, you can't hide from me dude <laughs> what I got cut got in pale can I go up there no I don't think I can We got the first boss. The Russia bar, was it? <laughs> Your life ends here. Not if yours ends first. I'm ready. I'm ready. Oh, I thought I could parry it. Well, I'm pretty sure I can parry it. There we go. I am a Sekiro god. You can't do this to me. You're not gonna do this, dude, buddy. Okay, man. Okay, that one's getting me a little bit. Okay. That one I can do. Okay. Ooh. It's very stylized. I like it. Shit, 
That's it? Really? Nah, there's gotta be more to this fight. Really? That's- I ho I hope the fights get a little bit more difficult. That was way too easy. Did you get? I hope you guys didn't struggle with that. That was way too easy, man. <laughs> the mighty Simurg, protector of Persia, has long left. But should our enemies try to take advantage of the situation, they will soon find that the kingdom's bravest warriors will be their undoing. So they're like the Avengers of the ancient world, I'm guessing. Thirty years ago. The divine bird Simorg graced my shoulder, thus showing his trust in me to guide our people. Today, I, Tamiris, Queen of Persia, praise your valor and loyalty, immortals. Varun, you and your forces have once again saved the kingdom. Hassan, Prince of Persia! Step forward, Sargon. Word of your deeds precedes you through the streets of Persepolis. Accept this royal sash as a token of our gratitude. Sargon, the Rashabar, the black wind that destroys all in his path. I didn't choose that name. You need not worry. I do not attach any importance to these superstitions. The winds also carry the seeds of future harvests. I am truly glad to meet you, Sargon. Thank you, Prince Hassan. Let us drop the honorifics. And may we get to know each other in less formal circumstances. As you wish, Hassan. <laughs> Sargon, man, you don't have to look... <laughs> he looks so pissed off, man. It's like the, the prince himself is giving you a little cloth, man. Like, act a little bit more happy and with a little bit more... I don't know. Grace was like, thank you. Uh, like, he's just being sarcastic. It took me an hour to beat this guy. I don't even... I don't even own the game? Oh, what do you mean? I don't know. I just... I hope the boss battle is a little bit more difficult than that. That was a little bit too easy. The highest in order to section reserve for most... So this is like the Medal of Honor, I guess. Oh, so you're not playing with the Prince of Persia. I'm sure it's going to be in a way similar to God of War 1, where it's called God of War, and he ends up becoming the Prince of Persia somehow. Your I think. Your name brings hope to Persia, and is feared by the enemy. What may be? I didn't ask to be Prince either, but fate has spoken, and I must accept it. <laughs> I, I, didn't fa I did not ask fate to become a millionaire, but hey, I accept it, okay? <laughs> But I get it. Being a prince back then was a lot more... It had a lot more responsibilities than just having fun. Varun, we're somehow the only immortals left here. The others are probably letting loose up on the roof. Not all warriors belong in the throne room. Join them, Sargon. I'll be along soon enough. Okie doke. Let's see. The last of us? Yeah, I've played it. Oh. Hey, Anahita. I'm proud of you, Sargon. I defeated Yuvishka, and we saved Persepolis. I was there. We? Thousands died on the battlefield. We're out of supplies. Persia is barely surviving. The Kashan will surely come back. Would you call that a victory? I let my pride go to my head. A warrior's journey is always one in progress. And when there's nothing left in one's path, the warrior wanders. What is at the end of my blade? I know. Found an answer yet? I won't figure that out tonight. Maybe a drink will help. You sh Thanks. But I have other matters to attend to. You have what it takes to become one of the greatest, Sargon. I know. Wasn't Sargon a king? In actual history? And listen to Varun. He will keep you on the right path. see what's near it's kind of nice that you get to walk around the oh 
Wait, is there a oh wait we got we got some platform in there. Oh <laughs> the game already knew I was gonna do this. Okay, hold on, because I can't really dash in the air still. Wait, his name is really similar to Dustin, the former Prince of Persia. Sargon? Hmm. I don't know. I don't really care who's voice acting him. I care about the direction and writing quality of the script. I know it has a lot of time travel and shit. I mean that's always Prince of Persia. Come on. Hold on. Got it. No! Okay. Am I... Okay, I was supposed to be here. I thought I was just discovering a little secret. So what's on the other side? Hold on. Hold on. This is always my issue with single-player games. I want to go and explore the optional areas first. Now, how much do you want to bet there's nothing here? Long live the house of Tamiris. Thanks. Thanks for that. Let's see what the... These guys are having a party at the rooftop. Persepolis, Perse Persepolis, one of the greatest places to visit. How? Like, what I'm asking is, like, is it still... Of course, it's not like, going to be as impressive as back in, t back in history, right? But are they still, like, places there? Places to visit, I mean? Like, temples and shit? <laughs> oh, that's nonsense. He looks nothing like you. He took everything from his mom, that's all. <laughs> Orad, you are really not her type. Who's type? Ah, the kid finally decided to join us. The hero of the day. <laughs> the queen's new protege. So, you're mingling with aristocracy now, eh? Or trading in your swords to become a satrap. Laugh all you want. Who eliminated a general tonight, huh? Don't encourage them, Sargon. It just means you've impressed them. Yeah, he's right. You were impressive. If you want to talk more quietly, no homo. <laughs> yeah. He bites 4K. Wait, what do you mean? What? No, wait a second. Is this really like the? No, no, no. Hold on, hold on. If you want to talk more quietly. No. No, it's not. It's 1080p. What do you thought? You scared me for a second. I'm like, what? I thought I had it at 4K or like, or like 40 40p or something. Um, am I the only one who thinks that the background atmosphere reminds me of God of War One? I guess a little bit of Athens. So, will you still remember us now that you're famous? <laughs> I'm trying to stay humble. Oh. Sounds like Anahita set your head straight. Um, sort of. In her own way. You know, it is amazing what you did. You should be proud of yourself. We all are. One of our own eliminated the Kashan general. Outstanding. <laughs> and you are the White Lion's pride. You ragtag bunch of immortals. <laughs> you have always been destined for greatness. And with Sargon's bravery, that's another one for the history books. We made the city safe. The people are at peace again. This is cute, but can we go celebrate now? Our usual haunts has food and drinks on the house. Barum, you're coming with us. I wouldn't miss it. Barum, Prince Hassan has been kidnapped. Holy <laughs> shit! They must still be in the palace. That was fast. Like, I was just... I guess it was... An, yeah, it was Anahita, of course, yeah. Like, that happened a couple minutes ago. Like... Alright, we run. Let's go. Oh, oh! I was just here. Come on. Do something. Wait. 
is the secret energy that burns in every living being. Okay. Okay, generates attacks. Generate Athra while taking damage, dispels it. Okay. Oh, nice. That's a different one. Oh, whoa, okay, I see a combo. Oh. But how are you? It's been a long time. I've been watching you since the uh, since the pre Ragnarok, where you stream Halo. <laughs> what more? What, what? I remember that. Yeah, I kind of gave up on that series. Oh, there she is. Anahita, what is this all about? I wasn't planning on killing you, Sargon. Stay out of this. Move out of my way. Child. Okay, Sargon, my dude. You could have gone around, you could have jumped over it. Oh! Wait, wait, okay. Can't be paired in trip. Okay, okay, I got it. Okay, alright, first death. I got this. The, okay, the little uh, tutorial there kind of messed me up a little bit. Fuck, okay, okay. Oh my god, okay. Damn it, okay. I got this, hold on, hold on, I got this. That's it? Alright, oh, that's pretty good. Anahita, what is going on? Sargon, who was it? I thought I recognized Anahita. Is she involved? Yes, she is. Without a doubt. Baron, gather your forces. You are to leave for Mount Kaf at once in search of Prince Hassan. Ardashir and his soldiers are already on the way. We need all the help we can get. How do they know they're going to mount a cough? We will not fail you, your majesty. Bring him back. 
Bring back my son. I mean, I'll give it that. The story just doesn't waste any time getting started. It's, it's already on its way. Hey, Jeffs, how you doing, man? I'm doing okay. Just hanging out, just playing some Prince of Persia. Uh, Sorkin looks like a, <laughs> like the dreadlocks Kratos lost brother. I've heard people make fun about the dreadlocks, and it's true that Western developers, whenever they design a black character, they're like dreadlocks. Like it's just like the go-to haircut. <laughs> Every single one of them has it, man. And I don't really see it that much, like in, in real life. So it is pretty funny. Uh, do you think I'll have to create a copy of the Blades of Cat? Okay, well, I'm not talking theories, but I think it's a real blade. I think he's gonna have it next time. Okay. Golden Age for Ubisoft in my eyes uh, was PS2. Yeah, then they got kind of greedy. I can't fathom why Anahita would do such a thing. Sargon, you know her best. What do you make of it? It doesn't make sense. She has always been loyal. She wants to seize power for herself. Oh, what do you even mean? The Simorg may have disappeared, but the mighty god used to live on Mount Carve. And perhaps still does. It has always been the Simorg who appoints future kings and queens. Hmm. Anahita probably wishes to receive the Simorg's blessing. But why kidnap Prince Hassan? She needs him. The gates to the Simorg temple only open for members of the royal family. She has lost her mind. She will never get the Simorg's blessing like that. We can't be certain. After all, the Simorg may be weakened. One thing's for sure. Prince Hassan is in danger. She will kill him once she has no need for him. Immortals, follow me. Let's help Ardashir and find Prince Hassan. <laughs> Wait for me here. Don't worry. I won't be long. Lost in Mount Calf. Oh, wait, let me see. Oh, I don't have the map yet. Okay. It is cool that this is pretty much the first uh, Metroidvania game that tells you where the next objective is. I always hate that. I, I Look, I liked... I remember there being a lot of controversy with uh, Metroid Lost Dread or something. The, la the last one, right? I know David Jeffy didn't like it. Been here before? No, but I've read about it. This place was once the site of King Darius's palace. Religion, medicine, astrology... Geometry, algebra, all knowledge was gathered here, accessible to all. Mount Kaf was home to a great citadel of wisdom, the pride of all Persia. And? What happened? No one survived to tell the tale. And to think that Prince Hassan is caught up in all this. Who knows what might await us? But like, I, I remember David Jaffe not liking Metroid Red, and uh, I don't really remember why. But for me, like, the issue why I stopped playing was because I kept getting lost. I'm like, I, I don't want to explore anymore. I want to be able to do what I have to do next. Why can't I... Oh, that's... I'm sad. You can't air dash like this early on in the game. Okay. He didn't like it because he stuck himself inside, like, inside an idiotic bit, pretty much. But it was funny, so I don't mind. <laughs> Algebra didn't exist yet. Well, it was sort of like... It's interesting, like, I've, I've been really, like, into the learning about the development of science and all that. And I found out recently that, you, you know, like, Greeks, how they did math was just through geometry. They didn't, like, have this number symbol type of thing. It was just, it was just deductively, like, the solutions were deductively reached via, like, axioms of, like, every line. Like, it, it's just geometry, right? And, yeah, algebra was, like, in the 1600s, right? Like, or when it, 1500s. Yeah. So yeah. No, they didn't have algebra back then. But I think algebra... No, that's algorithm. Algorithm comes from a a guy's name because the... Algebrizi or something. <laughs> like, it's a name that has survived. Like, it's cool. It's just... Anyway, I'm talking too much. I'm a warrior, not a seer. Frozen as it falls. As if time had stopped. Bro, I think you downloaded the wrong Valorant. I guess it's because of the art style. People were comparing it to Fortnite as well. 
But I like it. I, I don't like... I don't like 2D games that try to look as good as The Last of Us, for example. I like them to be more stylized. I think pixelated graphics are really underrated. Well, I mean, they, they all, indie games use them a lot, right? But I like this one. It's like cell shaded It looks good. One that I hated how it looked was... Um, oh, I broke something. The guy who made Symphony of the Night made another one recently. Something of the moon. I don't know. I didn't like the graphics of that game because it tried to be 3D. And it just didn't look very good. This one, on the other hand, looks really good. Stay sharp. Princess Anne can't be far now. Something is not right here. Yeah, true. We must proceed with caution. Sure, Mad Elias. You can scurry from shadow to shadow like frightened vermin. I'm serious, Orod. There's a strange presence here. I can feel it too. There's only one way to find out. <laughs> ah, let's go then. Yeah, there you go. Algebra comes from uh, Jabir, yeah. Alge Algebir, yeah. This is Azad, one of Ardashir's men. Long dead, judging by the rot. How is that possible? They left not long before us. Welcome here. Stay on your guard. We will find the prince and Anahita. We go east. We don't go anywhere. You'll only slow me down. You're on your own. Because this is the Rayman studio? This is their talent. What, platforming? Oh yeah. Why can't I dash? I want to be able to dash in the air so bad. Ugh, there we go. Okay, I can't open it. Woo! Okay, okay, hold on. Got him. Alright, better over. I gotta get back to my uh, my shift. <laughs> Take it easy. I thought you were at home, man. <laughs> yeah, get back to work. Be a good employee. Thank you for stopping by, dude. Um, can I break this? Maybe with... Nah, okay. That's something. another ability. Should Does that mean that I have to... I mean, I want to be able to open the map still. Big, uh, big Cuba, I mean, I'm... I mean, I am that Sherbin that told you of Shahame. I, I guess you said big fan Cuba, right? I don't know what you meant. Nobody. <laughs> but thank you. Yeah, you're the one who uh, mentioned this uh, Shahame thing, and I. And it's hard because I looked up Persian mythologies like books. I'm like, there's not that many. I'm sad. I died. But then I looked it up by the name Shahame, and it's like, dude, you got this full thing. On Audible, that it's just like well acted. Like it's so good for people who don't like reading like me. It's perfect, man. Oh, 
Oh, I missed. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna have to remember those abilities. Give me those things. There we go. You're gonna do. Okay, well, hold on. You're gonna do a full playthrough of the game, or are you just trying it out? I want to treat this live stream more as a hangout. Um, that's why I don't have like part one on it because uh, I don't. I don't have a lot of times these days, right? And I wish I could do a playthrough of it for you guys. But I don't want to have to wait a full week to play this again. That's another reason why I kind of lost interest with Final Fantasy 16. It had a lot of pacing issues, but it was also that thing that I had to wait a full week to play it. It just wasn't very fun. So I'll play this like on my own as well. And probably record my reactions to it in case there's something interesting uh, to record. That's what I'll probably do. Just not full playthroughs. No! Come, okay. I mean, I'm really gonna have to play careful here. It's not that difficult. It's just when there's a couple of them at the same time. That's when they get me. Now they're all dead. Fuck. I got this, I got this. This is why I like to play on a slightly harder difficulty. I, the game really forces you to learn how to play it. For the most part, it's the, if the game's good. I think I got it. That move is from Two Thrones. After, look, after this, I feel like I'm going to have to play the other uh, Prince of Persia games. Shit. Because I, I know, like, this this game is getting a lot of praise from... Similar to God of War 2018, right? It's getting a lot of praise from uh, mainstream. But the fans themselves are not completely happy with it because they wanted a 3D game. And I've never played those, except 2008. The 2008 one. So I'm gonna have to go and play Two Thrones and a Warrior Within. See, so like, just see what people are talking about. I know I read this, but I'm gonna read it again. Just make sure. Holds the key to the all truth. He's the guardian of time and destiny, keeping everything in balance. Infinite power, sights and sweaters. His protective fl flight brings peace and prosperity to Persia. Those lucky enough to be touched by the shadows, by his shadow, yeah, are forever protected by the forces of evil. Misfortune will befall those who try to harm him. Okay, okay, I got it. The bird's important. That's what I got. I came from here. I didn't forget Final Fantasy 16 lore, but it was also very, really simple, honestly. Man, that's another reason why I stopped playing the game. I found that just, I guess because I played like once a week only. But man, I got lost in that lore so many times. There were so many factions. Got him. Let's see. Man, the combat's good. You can't... I mean, I'm sure it's gonna get even better, but... Holy crap. Like, I'm... It's It's got a fun combat. What's up there? Anything up there? Okay, okay. I can get there. Just gonna get some more creative. Let's go. The chat didn't help. Yeah, everybody had like their own, <laughs> their own interpretation of things, <laughs> and it just kept getting me confused. Wait, what was up there? I went up there for no reason. What an idiot! Hold on. Wow. Okay, was nothing. That doesn't seem right. I'm gonna have to go to the other one now. I did this thing again. Oh, 
Oh shit. Woo! Okay, I think that was there in the demo. I think this is where the trees are? What, what does that mean? Those little leaves thing. I'm guessing it's the trees. Red Plains of Forest Denial Valley. I think I read that one as well. Oh no, okay, there's a tree. What are you doing here? This place is too dangerous for a child. Don't worry about me. I know the Citadel better than anyone. Is this Anahita? Like her younger self? Kind of looks like her. I know every step. I even go where others can't. I've chatted and argued with every creature. And I know every tree here. Like this one. Are they all like this? These trees are special. They're called Wack Wack. They have the purest of Athra. So, stand beneath its leaves to restore your energy. There are many Wack Wack trees throughout Mount Car. Tell me, you say you know all here. We're in search of soldiers like us. Our prince is being led by an... A general. Oh my god, I think this is Anahita. Because, for one thing, it says, kind of like the stranger from God of War 2018, it's just, it's young girl. And here, for someone who's, he didn't go all the way through, like, our princess is being held by Anna, a general. It's like, I get it, he doesn't say it because the child doesn't know. But it's more like, they don't want to, they don't want to say Anahita, and then the girl be like, Oh, that's that's my name. That's odd. Like they don't, they want to. I'm pretty sure. Don't tell me. I'm not looking at the chat. Okay. I'm not looking at. Don't tell me if that's Anahita. Okay. That's my own little theory for now. A prince. There hasn't been a prince here in so long. Well, if you've lost your friend in Mount Car, then you're going to need an eye of the one. What's that? It's a very rare, very ancient thing. Here for you. Explore the ancients. Yeah, add marker. Okay, I don't really like those. I might as well show you a neat trick to remember places on Mount Car. Well, I mean, I guess that is useful. I don't want to use this though. Do I have to use it? I think I'm forced to use it. Yeah, okay. Thank you, miss. I don't want to waste out. Uh, she's supposed to keep red torture if I wrote that right. I don't even know how to. I don't even know how to spell that thing. Um, who in the right mind names mystical trees? Whack whack. It just don't know your maybe name. it makes sense for the language. My name is Faraba. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I'm like that's Anahita. That, like it's Faraba. Like it's that. <laughs> Doesn't that sound impressive? Well, Sargon, I'm sure we'll meet again in Mount Car. I'll share my discoveries with you when I can. But time crystals. Oh shit. <laughs> Welcome to Mount Car. You want to make theory videos about this game too? I mean, I might. I, I kind of let that happen naturally. Like I'm really right now. I'm really into um into Bayonetta, but I realize it's been uh. I may have gotten a little bit over. I may have underestimated the task that it is to learn Bayonetta lore. Because at first, in the first two games, it's like, ah, it's cool, you know, it's a little bit of time travel. But apparently, in the third game, it just gets crazy with it. Okay, hold on, hold on. Hey, I mean, come here, come here. Gotcha. Oh! Ah! might be a little bit too difficult for me now screenshot the walk walk why would I do that why would I do that yeah I'm kind of sad that I'm 
I know I get it. You get them later on, but I want more abilities. I want to be able to double jump. I want. This guy got in the most uncomfortable place possible. What is he doing? You dancing? Oh my god, he's dancing. Look at that. Play some music, someone. <laughs> I'm just gonna leave him dancing there for a little bit. So how you guys doing? <laughs> you already did screenshot the walk walk? I think I did it in them one out here, right? <laughs> Uh, I never called the people who I believe to be speaking Arabic anything. I just said I thought they were all speaking Arabic. What do you mean? All right, let's go. Oh, because there's people in the chat talking Arabic. Yeah, look, if, if there if there's too many people who just speak a language that's not English, I usually tell them. But if there's two or three, I'm like, I just let them have it. Bug? Nope, it's a time anomaly. Just rewind the stream, LOL. It'd be funny if it was, but no, I, I know it's a pretty... I know it's a bug. Okay, so wait, the yellow... Sorry, the green crystals, what do they do? Do they give me points? Or is it health? It's just points, right? Yeah, okay, it's just points. Okay, I've been there. Oh! Break it. I think I remember this. Oh! Woo! Okay, that guy was pretty easy. It's for upgrades. Okay, I thought for a, for some reason I thought it was giving me health or something, but no, it's I know I get it now. What do we got here? Okay, I've been here before. Thanks for letting us speak our thing again. I mean, if it gets too overpopulated with these like people who don't speak English, I'm gonna have to say something because it's it's just hard, you know. Oh shit! What? Get some help. No, you didn't. Who's next? I thought I could hit this. No, never mind. I wonder how much do you know uh, of Persian mythology? Oh, practically nothing, dude. I, I don't even. I'm not even gonna pretend that. I'm like, I know what. Per I know. I know. Cl nothing. I'm not even gonna say close to nothing. I'm just gonna say nothing. Okay. I started listening to the book, but I'm still very early on. There's a cool character who makes a deal with the devil, and he gets snakes on his shoulders, okay? That's the thing that has stood out the most. I'm like, that's a cool character. And then Farah Doom is like, hey, you killed my cow. I'm going to kill you, but not really. He gets sent to what I think it's Mount Calf. I could be wrong about that. That's all I know based of what I listened to from the book, okay? <laughs> they aren't points or uh, currency like hack silver. Yeah, okay. Ah, okay, good. Ah, come on. Gotcha. Gotcha, bitch. Okay, I've been here before. Okay, no guys. Okay, no, we're not we're not doing politics here. No, 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 no. We're not we're not doing Iran versus USA things. Okay, keep it keep it cool. This is about it's about Persian mythology. I don't care what's going on in the world right now. Okay, I'm not here. Okay, yeah, I think it's better. I think it's better if we if we start the law of like speak English now. Okay, please. Okay, there's no there's so many mythologies that I don't know where to start when learning. It kind of, for me, it has to happen organically. I don't like to force any, anything on me, per se. I, I guess responsibilities. Aside from that, I just kind of like, ooh, side quest. I just saw it. Where's the map? Where's the map? Got it. Oh, 
Oh, okay, I remember. Okay. They did during the uh, Sinead Empire. Plot Twisky was secretly the Prince of Persia. I'm Captain Persia, man. Wait, that was that was the prince? Oh crap, oh crap. Ah! Man, I love statues. Wish I had the bow. Have I been here? Oh, 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 okay. No, this is new. I don't think I can make that jump, but I'm gonna try. Ah! No. Okay, I knew it was gonna work. Don't worry, Cuba. We'll teach you Persian. There you go. It's gonna be an informative stream. You're probably gonna teach me swear words, aren't you? The other button, other... Wait. The other button, other than the options, is the map. Oh, it is! I do have a map. Oh, okay. Thank you. You're right. Thank you. This is such a cool feature. Like, every Metroidvania game needs to have this now. What is this? Add marker? Have I been? Okay, no, that's the place. Oh, wait, so I can technically go and take a picture of that thing, right? That's so cool. Because, see, I'm like, oh, I don't know where I'll be able to go. And then I can be like, bam! Did I do it? I don't think I did. Wait. I... I might have already done it. Hold on. Oh, shit. I took two. Yeah, okay. My icon was hiding it. Okay, how do I remove them? Is there a way to remove them? There's gotta be... Oh, there's got to be a way to remove uh, markers. Otherwise, it's going to be, yeah. The number of screenshots available on the left. No, I saw them. I got 12 right now. And it's cool that... <clears throat> Take the prince to the Simor gate. Anahita. This wasn't in the demo. Don't you dare harm him. If you want Prince Hassan back, come and get him. Anahita. <laughs> Anahita was here. She's taking her sand to the Simor Gate. Then Artaban may be right about her wanting the throne. That thing above us. What is it? I'm what not thing? sure. But to get to Hassan and Anahita, we must destroy it. From this distance, that's not possible for either of us. Maybe Menelaus can help here. Varum sent him to the east to investigate the forest. I'll try ah. to find him. I'll look for another way. Okay, let me see. I love this. Oh my god. Thank you so much. I just... Thank you, Ubi. I can't believe I'm praising Ubisoft for something. I know I was here, but... I love... I love that they give me an objective within this huge-ass map, man. Like, it's so... I love it. Thank you so much, man. Rad, thank you so much, man. Super chat sound check. Oh, shit, yeah. I... <laughs> It's gonna happen later on. Thank you in advance, though. Let's see. This game makes me want... Well, now you, now I want a shawarma. I fucking love shawarmas, man. I haven't really eaten that many Middle Eastern foods. But shawarmas? Shawarmas and burritos are there fighting for, like, the pocket meat category. Like, they're so... They're so... You can throw in calzones there if you want to. Uh, calzone isn't a lower level. It's, bur it's between burritos and shawarmas, man. Like, they're just... They're fighting. What is this thing? What is this? I feel like this is something. This is gonna do something in the later on, I'm sure. I agree. I want falafel right now. Which one's the falafel? I don't think I've had that one. Oh, it's the elevator from before that I... Oh, yeah, there's a tree here, right? Oh, 
brings you here, Traveler? My allies and I are in pursuit. Oh, 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 oh. Super chat sound check. It will never not stop scaring me. Like, it just comes out of nowhere, man. It just pops up. If any of you ain't... ain't wait, if any of you ain't hatched a warm out, you seriously missing out. You are. It's the shit, man. And I don't... And it's funny. It's one of those uh, dishes where I'm like, I don't like beef here. I like chicken and for the most part i don't like chicken but that chawarma chicken mm, awesome man. it just it always scares me anyway my my eyes are in pursuit of three. you and the others are trapped here too mount calf has seen its share of travelers beware warrior death and misery roam the citadel i've seen my share of death even the most determined of warriors must be prepared Its unique properties will aid us know that each one is precious and can only be changed as a whack whack tree. I'll make good use of this. Slightly increased max health. The additional health boost can only be generated at whack whack trees. Ah, okay. Where's the, where's the nearest tree? There it is. Okay. Let me look at the amulet things real quick now. Uh, rip you anyone watching on TV. Oh yeah, I feel like I feel like I'm gonna have to change that eventually. People, <laughs> they're like, "Hey, Dad, Mom, gather around. Let's watch the super chill guy, Prince of Persia." Oh! <laughs> All right, let's see. Okay, hear a special sound when near treasure chests or hidden items. Okay, I guess you hear the birds. That's going to be misleading, man. It's just a bird sound. All right, let's see. Hey, where's that bird? Oh! That's cool, man. You get to travel with it. Welcome. Oh, I can buy stuff. Amulet holder. Okay, increases the number of amulets. Ooh, Xerxes, old currency. Slightly reduce incoming poison effect damage. I'm, this is an amulet, right? I, I love it. I love it when there's visual things, man. I just love it. That's something I hated about uh, 2018. It, it's like the buttload of runes, man. And they all look similar. Like, look at this. You got a nice Xerxes coin there. You got a nice little snake to symbolize the poison effect. You, 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 I don't know. This, this just looks like an empty frame. But I'll, I'll come back to these things later on. Um, you will have a bird. Okay. I guess the bird is the one that tells me. Let me look at it. Hold on. If I take it off, I'm pretty sure it's the bird. If I take off. Yeah, okay. So it is the bird. Okay. Let's go. It does, um, it does to all of us, my guy. What happened? You can delete the screenshot. Press X to view. Oh, wait, wait, hold on. Press X. Oh, I see. There we go. Cause I just don't like the messy like map. Like this is cool. Like I just I have one. It's nice. Oh fuck. Okay, hold on. Got him. I need some more health. Wait, wait, there's... Okay, let's go up the... Let's go up... Wait, I heard... I heard him chirp. Yeah, okay, he's... He's chirping. Let me go up the elevator first. Because I think that's where... Um, Kahiba is. Oh, what's that up there? Uh, I'm guessing that's something else. See, now I'm afraid. <laughs> now I'm gonna be hoarding all of my screenshot like things. I'm like, should I take a picture here? I'll I'll take one. Okay, just 
Okay, there we go. I, I don't know what. <laughs> I hope. I hope I'm not wasting them, man. Okay. There we go. To the upper. I was playing this game, and this game is really amazing. It reminds me of Betrayal, but with better graphics. That's what I'm saying. Like, this is what Betrayal should have been. Like, I heard people for the longest time say, like, no, 2D God of War game would be lame. Like, what are you talking about? Like, we haven't, we've not really gotten a good hack and slasher 2D game. I feel like this one is the first. Like, it's a really good one. Yeah, you can tell a joke. I might not get it, but go for it. Upper City West. Hey, what? I don't know you could do that. That's gonna be useful. I got too greedy. Ah! Oh. Where's he gonna respawn me? Oh, okay, so it's, uh, in a way, it's similar to Dark Souls with a checkpoint system. I hope not. I hope it's not the case. Did you notice Helios makes reference to Hades by saying it's overwhelming, really, like Hades said? He does a lot of those things, uh, Luke. Like, he quotes uh, Hermes as well in, in, a, in an instance. So, and even Athena at the end, like, I made a short about that. I think it's... Oh, the bird's getting... The bird's lagging. <laughs> uh, I think it was meant to... Uh, it, it's small little references, but also to give you that dream feeling as well, where it's like, this sounds familiar, but it's not quite right, you know, in the place where you expect it to be. Okay, I can't really make that jump just yet. Guys, guys, don't spoil. Just say it in a different way. Okay, wait. wait. Who's Who's spoiling? Wait, wait. That doesn't make Cuba. That doesn't make theory videos. Here is your answer. Oh, that's the joke. Oh, okay. What do you call like? What do you call Cuba that doesn't make theory videos? Cuba that doesn't make theory videos. Here is your answer. I don't get it because I don't do theories. I just give answers. Oh, Sargon is just sitting. He's just chilling. Hold on. Anyway, I don't know if I should make. Rat RGS Slinger 10 the uh, a mod because he says like people are spoiling. What are they spoiling? Is it spoiling this game? All right, let's go. Whatever. We'll figure it out. Oh shit, dude. Okay, okay. I don't think I should have gone up here. This guy. Okay, so there's a secret, apparently. Okay, I'm gonna fight him. No, fuck it. Let's go. Is that red? Doku Gamer, welcome to the Spartan soldiers, man. The Spartan army, I mean. I'll get him eventually. Hold on. Appreciate the... I, I would say sub, but that's not Twitch. I appreciate the membership and welcome. Uh, Pop 1, 2 were already brilliant. Damn it. Okay, you know, okay, I'm not going to look up uh, Slinger. I'm going to call you Slinger. Let's go, let's go. I heard today that Ubisoft wants to remake the Black Flag. What do you guys think about that? I feel like they should still work on <laughs> They should first work... Have I gone to the other side? I feel like they should work first on the... Uh, on the Prince of Persia remake. Whatever happened to that? I know they're still working on it, but... Okay. Hold on. I will get that guy. He's not... He's only a little bit difficult. That's it. Maybe I just shouldn't be here. Okay, come on. Let's go. Okay, just think. 
fucking shit, that move. What was that? Is he? Ah! Oh my god! I am dedicated. I'm not. I'm stubborn at this point. I'm gonna beat him. Fuck it. I'm not. I'm not gonna take no for an answer. I'm doing it. The remaster AC3, which was kind of bad. Yeah, I think they just made it more yellow <laughs> or something. But I think it was a it was a remaster, right? It's not the same as a remake. They also remastered AC2 and made it worse somehow. I remember that. Okay, if I fail now, even though I said I was going to take no for an answer. Okay. Ah! Got him, finally! What is that? Yes! Okay. Dude, that guy was giving me a hard ass. Okay, what is he saying? What, what is this bird telling me? He's telling me there's something here. Man, okay. Pro trip. Thanks. Thanks, uh, Sahad. Or Sajad. Thank you. Appreciate it. Oh. That's what I don't like about... There's a similar mechanic to, like, this bird and Returnal. And I just... I can never use it because I just... I'm not creative enough. Like, he's... He's telling me there's a secret here. But what is the secret? No, up. Up. It's kind of hard with just... There we go. You fucker. Ah! Uh. That. Slightly increases old melee attacks damage in the air. Equip your amulet. Okay, cool. Okay, that was worth it, I would say. <laughs> Dude, this, the, like, <laughs> God. the margin of error there is so tiny. Let's see. Okay, at least I got it. Okay, I got it, got it. I think out of War 2 started the thing with red attacks that cannot be parried nor block. I think you're right. I don't think I've seen another game really do that before. Oh shit. Got him. Wait, what's down there? Let me check down there first. Oh. Oh, I see. Okay, the yellow the yellow loot is the one that gives me health. Oh. Huh. What do we got here? 
What if I do it from high up? Can I do it? Hold on. I think that's the secret. Where would it be? I feel like there's... I'm not gonna take a picture of it, because even if I take a picture, I won't know what it is. But I will tell you, platforming and puzzles are so good in this, and very well thought out. I'm waiting for those. Oh, I think we got one right here. Okay, hold on. I'm just, right now, I'm just, like, exploring the map. You will fall on the floor with this joke. What is, why did Cuba remove his coat? What coat, what are you talking about? Okay, I guess we'll go and do this one. Okay, wish me luck. I was supposed to do this. Okay. What was that? Can someone tell me what that does? Because I think I did it in the demo as well, and I wasn't sure. Hey, what the fuck is that? Ew. No, what is this? No, 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 no. No, what, why am I connected to Ubisoft Connect and shit? No, 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 no. How do I get rid of that? I don't want that. Okay. I, I'm going back now? Oh, that, okay, that's how you open it. Okay, never mind. The bird keeps telling me there's a secret here. Um, there's a troll in you. I actually like an AC Rogue remake. It's very short and underrated due to its release the same as AC Unity. Wait, it, did it really release on the same day as AC Unity? That's just a bad decision. Oh, I don't think this was... I don't think this was here in the demo. Warriors. Where was the, oh? There's the insignia. Wait, insignia for Cephalus. Nojin was an Adashir right hand man, a good tactician, and but he stayed away from the battlefield whenever possible. So what do I use that coin for? I don't think there's an amulet, right? No, it's not an amulet. Something else. Um. It's a prequel to the main story trilogy of Prince Persia. This is a... Okay, this is a prequel? Okay, that's cool. Oh! Nice! We gotta... I, this is giving me, like... This is a puzzle. You never really see puzzles in Metroidvania. At least the ones I've played. Okay, 
okay, hold on. Ah! How do I get up there? Uh, okay, wait, wait. There's gotta be something to it. Gotta open it more. I think I got it. Stop, stop, stop moving, stop moving. Thank you. Nice! Okay, wait, wait. I like, oh man, I, oh, I like me some platforming puzzles. That's good. Okay, good stuff. Is this a place for, oh, we got a boss fight. Who's this? Okay, that was gonna happen. Okay, we all knew that was gonna happen. Okay, it's a side mission. Wait, what is this? Is a side mission? Really? Too early. God damn it. This game is giving me. Oh, it's nice that it restarted me right there. I like it. I like that a lot. Let's go. Nice. Nope. Okay. Okay. All right. I love it. See this. This kind of shows what I don't like about Dark Souls games as much. It's that whole thing was like, oh, you died. Now you have to walk three miles. No, no, just give me the same challenge. I don't mind redoing it. Just don't make me, like, backtrack all the way. Ah, looks like the game from Fall Fiction <laughs> kind of does. Damn it. Okay. I got this. I got this. Okay. Oh my god. Okay. Why do I keep doing it early? so close. I was so close to it. Oh god.
I got it, I got it. Ah, fuck! <laughs> <laughs> I love parrying in games, but apparently I'm not very good at it. boys. I'll get him though. Got him. I like the whipping sound. Okay, drink, drink. Oh my god! It's that spinny attack, man. It's the one I can't really gauge when it's gonna happen. I thought I forgot I had this. Got him, got him. Oh no, don't do this to me now. back <laughs> sorry <laughs> not even reboot it's just this game takes place way earlier than the original trilogies that's what i was wondering i was wondering if this thing was canon to the other prince of persia games i'm glad it is all right that kick is kind of funny it is it has like a whipping sound hold on i got this i was so close that time so so close Don't go. I can't. Finally, okay. Oh my god, what is that? That took me a while. Soma tree petal. Okay, yeah. So like the Gorgon eyes. Good to know, okay. Uh, I hope we get a hot, <laughs> hot chick from Warrior Within. I haven't seen him yet. I don't think it is. Original games happen in Babylonia... Babylonia... Babylon and in India. This is the first mention of Mount Calf. Well, I'm get. I might sound like an ignoranus here, but 
what do you mean ba Babylon and India? Like, it's Prince of Persia? Unless Babylon and India back in the day were part of, like, Pers of the Persian Empire? Like, what do you mean? I, I, I'm confused. Finally got him. Oh. Hey, wait. What's happening to me? Wait, who are you? You just disappeared. It's the prince? Hey, what's... Uh, hold on, what's back there? What, why, why did we miss it back there? Something I do wish was the case is that I could keep running, like, well after... I go into a room. Ah, okay. I don't have access to it yet. I'm not really sure how to open that. Damn, we're in the chat. Isn't the city Babylon in Iraq? Yeah, I could have sworn it was, yeah. Like, a lot of, like... There, there's a lot of those ancient civilizations that are all, like, in the same place. Like, they were just, like, dethroned by the other one. Like, like the Sumerians, right? I think the Babylonians are the ones who defeated them. And then they became the Persian Empire, I think. Okay, so far the game is just funneling me into one direction because I can't even seem to go up there. I'm going to need a double jump or something. Hey. up here what's with the bird he's supposed to tell me see like uh, secret locations and stuff but so far he ain't doing any of that okay I got some health back it's pretty good like the Roman Empire yeah I know the Greeks I know the Romans were conquered no sorry the Greeks were conquered by the Romans But Macedonia was before that, so that's why there's a lot of like these ancient empires that <laughs> they look very similar but are completely different. Ah, oh, I thought I could parry it. Please don't send me back to the walk walk tree, please. Are you serious? <laughs> You're gonna send me all the way here. God damn it. Okay. Uh, I guess I'll go up now. Might as well explore something new. See what's up there. Nice. That attack, man. Oh my, I suck at this game. Okay. You could take on a Roman soldier. Yeah, good luck with that. I think, I don't know if, I, maybe it was like propaganda by the Roman Empire, but I think I heard somewhere that Roman soldiers were meant to... That's probably fake. <laughs> I heard it as a kid and I just kind of regurgitated it, like just kept saying it, but I'm like, that can't be true now. Like a Roman soldier was meant to fight... Nice. Just a single Roman soldier, soldier can take on a hundred soldiers, like, head on, like, one after the other. I don't think. I don't know if that's true. They were cool and all that, but not that cool. Are you serious? You, you, you too serious now? Yeah, I can't go in here. Shit. No! Okay, I can't go here. So we are going to have to go back. I don't think you suck. I think the developers are just plain vindictive. Now, I mean, the game is just... 
It's a, it's got a nice challenge at least so far. I like it. I'm struggling a bit, but it's it's all good. You can also use your bow. You I don't have the bow yet. Like it's that was only available in the uh, in the demo. I'm gonna have to get it later on. I think there's a walk walk tree here. What is that yellow thing? Like it's just telling me there's something here. Play and beat Dark Souls Trilogy Cuba? I don't know about that, dude. Um, the only Dark Souls game I've completed is Dark Souls 3. And I don't know, I just I don't see myself replaying them again. I do want to play Sekiro again. Especially after this with all the parrying. Oh, my bad, guys. We got a walk walk tree! Rise. Okay, good. Hello. Hello. Uh this is the first time you're meeting a whack whack tree. Uh we got a Mimir here, what's going on? I've seen these trees along my journey, but you're the first to speak. <laughs> no, no. I'm not a whack whack tree. I live in it. There are many whack whack trees across the citadel. Their branches are a refuge for us, and also a great help for travelers like you. Yes. I've noticed. These trees have always been here, since the start of all life. Their roots are deep, nourished by the primordial Afra that resonates within all things. But now, the forest suffers. Amidst the curse, a creature from elsewhere sows more misfortune and desolation. Here, take this. You'll need it. Create an explosion and healing zone that gradually restores health. Nearby enemies are pushed back. Can only be triggered from the ground. Okay. Let's see what it does. Oh, yeah. Th I think this is one from the demo, right? That's cool. So if you stand on this spot, you get to heal, right? Be careful, Sargon. People get lost in the forest. Stay a while. Take refuge with us. Thank you for the warning. But I'll be fine. All of the forest is dying. The one in the forest feeds and feeds. Isn't it the curse that is killing the forest? The curse, yes. Broken time means broken space. She came from elsewhere through a broken door. Oh, shit. I see. An uninvited creature has come to take advantage of Mount Calf's misery. It's the same as the enemies of Persepolis. This, I can deal with. You're a very brave one. Okay, is there more to talk? So someone broke through space-time. Venture carefully. The Forest Queen hears all. Okay, so she's the Forest Queen. Okay, good to know. Um... The one in the forest, dot, dot, dot. Wait, hold on. Maybe there's a side quest? What? What? Okay, I thought it was a side quest, but it, it was just, I don't know, teasing the next adventure, I guess. Oh, he dead.
a beautiful beard like Cuba. I can't really grow like in this area here. Like it's kind of patchy. It's a nice little beard, nice little stash, but that's about it. That's that's all. That's the best I can offer. And what are those? Okay, I. Sometimes I know that something's gonna hurt me in a game, but I just gotta make sure anyway. Okay, there's two paths here. Let me go here. First. Oh, hello there. Oh! This is like the guy I just fought. Is it him? You there. Will you help this time? Oh. This time. I just came this way. I knew this forest was rotting my mind. Do you sense it? Something wicked has drained life from this place. All of Mount Carp is cursed. That's what you sensed. Cursed? I don't recognize your armor. You're not a soldier of Ardashir. We've come from across the seas to attack the Palace of Darius. But we're ensnared. King Darius? He's been dead 30 years. The palace here is deserted. So long? Quick, go find my brother in arms. He'll help me get out of here. I don't know what I have to offer, but I promise I'll make it worth your while. Help me before my mind rots more. I mean, yeah, I'll accept Nothing it. Natural about this place. Hurry, find my friend. What do you guys think? Should we go and stop the? Find my friend. He'll know how to free me. Who is your friend? Troll of Prince of Persia. I mean, they do have like the same similar weapon. Okay. Uh, hold on. A soldier from an invading army at the fall of King Darius. Sargon wishes to know more. Unfortunately, as time, time's curse pulls the man's memory. The only concern is being free from the plague forest, freed from his trap. He may provide some answers. Yeah, but where do? Oh, they have a lore thing. Sargon was taken in as a child by General Anahita. Setting high standards, she taught him the art of war and made him fight the fighter he is today. On his eighth birthday, Sargon Tudor gave him a necklace bearing an amulet to ward off evil spirits. Ah, that's cool. Okay. Yeah, I know that one. A decorated jar containing a vivid and sparkling golden sand. Oh, the sense of time? Each flask found reveals a portion of destiny. Oh! Oh, okay. That's interesting. Okay, so it doesn't tell me. Hey, hey, Thad, Tadpole, how you doing, man? I would accept any beard. I can grow a crap. I mean, I think you mean cap? <laughs> crap? <laughs> crap? <laughs> yeah, this guy came to came here, attack King Darius, and stuck here for 30 years while his fellow warriors rot and died. It's interesting. I, I, I do love a trippy time travel story. I really have to watch Tanit again. I didn't get it the first time. Oh, shit. Oh, I think this is the first... Whatever put him up there. It's a grisly fate. The armor looks old and tattered. A cannonball. I can use it? There's no way I can use it. It's just, he was just carrying a cannonball. Did they have cannon? I mean, I don't know. Okay, King Darius. When did they have cannonballs back then? I think China maybe had them. No, I, it doesn't sound right. Is he from the future? What's going on here? Okay, but like, you like the mythology of Prince Persia? I think it's very cool. I, I'm slowly getting into it. This game is opening the door for more. I don't know. For my Prince of Persia fandom in a way. Okay, 
Um, I, ha I definitely have to study more uh, Persian mythology. Sorry, I'm just missing the thing. Would you ever try a Baldur's Gate 3? If I try it, I'm going to try it with my wife because she likes RPGs more. And speaking of trying things with my wife, that sounds like a weird like lead-in. I heard, because she, I know she likes a lot of Pokemon, right? I heard that there's a new game called Pal World or something that's really good. And it's, you know, it kind of takes inspiration from Pokemon. Have you guys tried it? Is it any good? Oh, that's one of the guys I'm supposed to free, I'm pretty sure, right? Crap. He fucked me up. I see how it is. Have you seen the Atreus game leak? I have not, because it's not real. Where? Where is it? What's the leak? <laughs> I'm sure it's nothing, but still. Where have been here? Keep finding all the side missions. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, ah, okay. Just play the trilogy, man. It's so good. After this, I'll play it. Definitely. Okay, wish me luck, guys. I'm ready. I'm ready. Fucking shit. Dead? Got him. Okay, yeah, so he was one of those guys. I picked up something. Insignia of Persepolis. Okay. Was always very fond of B. John. Who's B. John? Maybe I haven't met him first yet, I think. Have you ever actually done the Sith cosplay? You know what? I, at this point, we've talked about it so much, and I'm kind of worried that we're not going to do it. I want to do it, but my wife is sort of just like procrastinating with it. We might, we might start today. Okay, it's one of those things that you're just supposed to do it instead of just talking about it. We bought all the stuff, and I think her uh, sewing machine came, came in already. So I'll definitely ask her about that. Now go back to the warrior who gave you the side quest. Wait, wait, which one? Which one? Uh, this guy? Or? He died somewhere here, I think, right? I think he was here. Is that the guy you're talking about? Oh, crap. Whew. Fuck. Oh, no. Oh, God. Yeah, that guy. Which one? First or second one I mentioned? <laughs> I'm guessing you meant... I guess I'll, I'll go to the first one, see what happens. But I don't think that was his army. You want me to go to the one that died or the one that's up here? I should have been more specific. The second one. Okay, good. How do I... How do I do that spinny attack thing? I, that just looks fun to do, but... Oh, I got it, I got it. Okay, I was going the wrong way. Do I like Sif or Athena? I like them both. I, uh... I guess Athena is more like... The one I would want to date the most? Ah! I don't know. Sif seems kind of nice, too. My friend dead. You're sure? I am. 
I killed him. I thought so much. <laughs> Freedom. One way or another. You said you were attacking the palace. What can you recall? Nothing. Fragments. Oh, but her whispers are poison. H how long has it been? You said 30 years. 30 years. Yeah. Imagine so many years. And not feeling time pass. For others, it may feel longer. And all of Mount Calf cursed. Why? I don't know. Some say it's because the Simorg vanished. The Simorg? It's real? I always thought so. But it's gone. Shh. More whispers. Do you hear? I don't hear anything. The evil of this place. It's more than just a curse of time. Even though he's dead, she'll feed off him. Okay. Oh, okay. Thank you, uh, Slinger, for telling me because I didn't know I was going to get something back. What's she doing? Oh! That's what the cannonballs were. <laughs> Where did he go? What the hell? He just dipped. Okay. That's fine. We have we have our own mission. Okay, there's this bird, man. I'm 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 gonna turn him off. Okay. He just keeps chirping, and I don't even know where it is. Hold attack button after the end of combo for spinning attack. Okay, I gotta be. Got it. Okay, thank you. It can't be just one. It's gotta be two. Okay, I haven't been here. I don't think I have anything else. No, good to go. Oh, enemy, okay. I wasn't sure, I was just trying to hit the bird. Are you serious? Come on, buddy. What, why are you chirping? Okay, there's a secret here? Where? Damn it! This bird. Oh my god, dude. I need the bow and arrow so bad. Finally. Don't like this bird. I should maybe go up there. Oh, I can't. Oh, no way I can. Hold on. I'm gonna go ahead and mark this. No, what a way. Okay, actually, it's not very clear, but okay, that's fine. That's okay. I keep wasting those things. Oh? Sharpen along with remnants of dried blood. Okay. Yes, it's in the move, but a lot of abilities are five are given at the start, but uh, to try out, given you over a, an overall feel. Yeah, that's what I was wondering, and I don't know why I didn't think of like, yeah, of course I'm not gonna get all of these things right away. But I would, I would expect at least the dash one to be a thing. But okay, no, 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 no waste it. But I've been here, right? I've been here. 
Okay, we gotta keep moving. Let's go. Hey, AK, how you doing, man? So, Kiva, it's almost confirmed that they're doing the remake. I wouldn't say that. I feel like there's gonna be something for the anniversary. That's that's all I think. I don't know if anything is. I don't think anything is confirmed yet. But I hope so, man. Oh, hey, Kevin, how you doing? There's so many places to go. Where am I now? Oh, wait, this is where I'm supposed to go. Oh, 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 my God. Okay, I'm fighting someone now. Oh, that was the tusk I just picked up, right? Bring it on. Okay, okay, okay. Come on. Get it. Oh, fuck. Oh, I made it somehow. Well, that's okay. Okay. All right. I got this. I got this. Got a poor live action is already confirmed. That one is. They've confirmed that they're um, already writing it, so that's pretty good. We might hear. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe we'll hear something about it this year. Yeah, that takes a long time to like recover from it. Damn it. Let me get some health. Got him. I get new amulet convert convert a small amount of damage taken into equips your amulet that so it does it automatically that's pretty good it has a I think that this amulet system is very similar to hollow knights I like it Demongi Pumba <laughs> Demongi Pumba I know how to I mean I said it with a Spanish accent that's pretty funny come on Let's see. I'm gonna make Cory Barlock fall in love with me so he tells me all the future plans. That that'll work. Yeah. Go for it. I want I do it live. Not live, just do it publicly, okay? Start sending him like little poems on, on Twitter. Am I the only one who got the uh Genji vibe? <laughs> what do you mean Genji? What is that? Genji's impact? Oh, cutscene. Is that me? 
Oh my god, that's me. No, I love this. Thank you so much. They're like, now these things are open. Thank you. Metrovanians don't do this shit, man. Okay, good, good. Got the bow now. The Dark Prince reference? Again, I, I don't know anything about Prince of Persia lore, man. Let me see that new amulet. Convert a small amount. Which one do I want? I'm gonna get rid of this fucking bird. It's not doing sh Oh, wait. Insufficient slots. I need four? Wait, what? Hold on. So this one takes two, but this one only one. Oh, 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 okay. Just below the amulet thing, it's confusing me like one out of three amulets, right? Oh, I see. This one tells you. Takes one. This one takes two. This one, nothing? This one doesn't take anything? I guess not. Alright, let's go. I don't have anything else here. You should try Warrior Within and Two Thrones. I will, guys. Oh. Come on. I'll eventually, like, after I finish this game, I might start getting into more Prince of Persia games. Which way should I go? I know this... The game is telling me to go here. But what's back there? What's on the other side? Yeah, the bird seems to take no... S oh! Orod, how you doing, man? Orod. Man, Elias isn't with you. We got separated. Why? It's strange. I encountered another version of myself. A warrior who looked just like me. <laughs> what are you talking about? You are not welcome here. What was that? What? Some beast too scared to even show itself. That's what. Now where did it go? I want myself a real fight. Good luck to you, Sargon. Try not to go mad! <laughs> so... Okay. There's nothing here, right? Did I get it? Okay, I'm not reaching it. No, I'm not doing that. <laughs> Bro just carrying an anchor. <laughs> I called it out. I'm like, what is he? What, what weapon is that? I've never seen something like that. It's, I guess it's a bit of an axe and spear at the same time. Oh, look at this forest, man. I love it. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Well, now I got a bow. Gotcha. Now I, now I kind of want God of War to go into Persian mythology. Look at that. Look at that statue. You, you guys know me. I like me some good statues. And that's a good statue. All right. Let's go up here. Hey, honey. Uh, oh, it's three already. Mm, maybe like an hour, another hour? Oh, okay. These are Sumerian texts. That's her writing. Athra, the eternal essence, the binding force that weaves the fabric of the cosmos, holds sway over all. It is the flame that burns and yet remains unburnt, the very essence of its ex ah, existence itself. Its presence and benediction extend across the expanse of creation. It is proclaimed that life is an amalgamation of Athra, Athra a thriving and con 
a thriving and contented mortal being embodies a dynamic yet harmonious union of diverse aspects of Athra defines our essence. It encompasses both the tangible and intangible realms. We got some deep metaphysics here. From the corporeal to the eth ethereal, it permeates all forms of being. Ever ablaze within our spirits, Athra dances in our ceaseless metaf metamorphosis. Transitioning from one aspect to another, it's, it neither emerges nor succumbs. Instead, it undergoes perpetual transformation in its multiple manifestations. Damn, this game is getting deep. Okay. By this... Uh, by discerning the canons of Athra's flow, one can navigate ex navigate exercise and therapies, granting abilities and longevity upon those who seek its guidance. Radhi, Moon Kumar, Sorry Astrian Priest, and Pacifist Warrior. A pacifist warrior? It's kind of an oxymoron, isn't it? Freya's Forest. Why are you killing Rio? Who's Rio? Oh, what is that? Oh, that is new. Okay, hold on. Okay, I'm out of arrows. How do I get up there? Shit. This guy is getting annoying. Yeah, I think I'm going the right way. Wait, what's up there? Can I go up there? On the other side? There's another one? Wait. Save the screenshots, Cuba, so you can explore it later with abilities you don't have now? What screenshot? Oh, yeah, you're right! I didn't take... Where Orod was, right? This place here? I'm not gonna go back now. How do I get back there? Okay, hold on. What exactly is that? It's on the other side. Oh, okay. It's that thing. Yeah, you're right. Okay. Uh, let me... Yeah, that's the thing. I got a screenshot. Yeah, thank you. There we go. Okay. That was kind of a waste, but okay. I don't really need that. Where's the cabbage? The cabbage is not making an appearance today, okay? The cabbage got a little bit too out of hand uh, last time. The delay is pretty severe. Makes me... Makes it hard to give gameplay recommendations. Wait, what delay? What are you talking about? So, Athra is like Chi in Chinese mythology? Hmm. Just plan what a what a game. Once you get X traversal, it goes insane. That's why I mean, like so far it's very plain. I ho I'm hoping it gets it gets there's I hope there's more to it, you know, which but I'm sure there will be. I wanna unlock the what do you call them? What did someone call them? The um the platforming challenges. That's that's what I'm looking forward to. Shit, are you okay, hold on. What the fuck? Oh, come on, man. <laughs> oh, my God. My... Are you fucking serious? Are you serious? <laughs> ah! <laughs> How do I... 
do I get back up there? That one is so good. You will love it, man. I know I will, but so far I'm not really showing my abilities as a platformer lover. I'm really gonna have to go all the way back, really. Okay, good. Nope. Why? Okay, let's go. How are you platforming a game that... Oh, platinum in a game, okay. Hold on. Just gotta take this. Just gotta have faith. Okay. Oh, you know what? It's already getting kinda good. I like it. Nice. Okay, we made it someplace new. Hey, what's here? There's nothing there. Woo! Oh, I'm not gonna get the points. Fair. Okay, there's a secret here. No idea what that secret is, but... Wouldn't be a secret otherwise. <laughs> Why is he chirping? What's here? Yeah, I need that. Oh, oh, it's here. It's there. What? What is it? What is he trying to... Can someone tell me? I have no idea what he's trying to say. That? No. <sighs> Kiba, can you speak Norse? No. Not even close, man. I can't even pronounce her names half the time. Oh, that was a nice little backflip. It's a walk walk tree. The Soma tree. I know I'm not supposed to be here, but. Oh, shit. Are you serious? Wait, wait. What is that? I feel like I can break this. This doesn't feel very secured. I don't know. Am I doing something wrong here? Chill, bird! Okay. I'm gonna screenshot this because I have no idea what this is here. Sorry guys, I open the map in these games a lot, I'm sorry. Future powers needed. I, I, I figured that out. I really don't like Ubisoft Connect telling me that I got a trophy. I don't like that one bit. Actually, you aren't supposed to be there. That's why you aren't having, you're having trouble platforming. Okay, okay. Fair enough. What the hell? Oh shit, hold on, hold on. Damn, nice. Got him. It's getting good. You can't turn off. I have no idea if I can. I don't I don't know where to. Oh, and I was going to ask you guys something. I bought 
It doesn't say, but I bought the deluxe edition and it says it came with a a digital guide or something that seemed very lore heavy. Like, where can I get that? Do you guys know? Okay, I'm not much. Hey, Men Elias. Men Elias. You're alive. And that amazes you somehow? I found your bow. Hmm. Different possibilities all unfolding at the same time. It may be worrisome, but at least I know my bow is in good hands. Anahita is taking her sand to the top of the citadel. Right. To the Simor Gate. Before I forget, my bow serves a dual purpose. You may want to take another look. I'll meet you up there. What? Whoa. Whoa, whoa. Grappling hook? What does it have to do with the bow? A ranged weapon that comes back to Sargon once thrown. Hold triangle to aim precisely with the shock. Okay. It becomes the bow? I guess it becomes the bow. Ah! <laughs> okay, that wasn't explained in the, in the demo. It's interesting. What's here? Okay, obviously I can't go there. What about early access? Keep it. The guy got spoilers for the entire game. Okay, no, I'm, I'm assuming it does, but I just I don't know how to access it. Can you tell me where it is? I wish I could throw it on the air, like, while I'm high in the air. Look at those. I mean, I just love mythological settings. This looks looks great. Okay. So we got a new set of puzzles now. Oh, shit. Oh, crap. What am I doing? <laughs> that was a little bit too close. That, wow. Okay. Oh shit. That was dumb. Okay. I like this. I like this shit. Hold on. Oh! <laughs> Man, why? Why do some people don't like platforming? It's so rewarding. What is this? A rare metal with a pale bluish tint uses reinforcing material and ancestral technique you still use from some forges. Okay. Damascus ingot. Okay. Like, I don't even care that I got a little... I don't, even, I don't care that I got a little bit of currency to make weapons with. I just... I like the platforming itself. Like... That in and of itself is fun to do. Like, you don't have to reward me. That is the reward for me. I love it. Okay, what do we got here? Puzzles uh, do get as good. I hope so, man. I mean, I, so far they're pretty good, okay? Uh, you see, I told you platform gets better. Okay, I know. I trust you. I trust you, okay? Uh, Captain, wait. Capital Hollow Knight? Blasphemous 1, 2. Celeste. I love Celeste, dude. It's called the Hero Slayer and a lot around the the indie stuff. Hollow Knight, I love it. That's another one that's platform heavy. And it's, um, why does the bird want? It That one's more like uh, the mechanics it uses is the, the bounce off mechanic. I don't know what you would, the pogo stick mechanic. Like, it's pretty fun too. But man, the, pla the platforming here is more traditional in a way. I miss it. I don't think I got any amulets, right? Any new ones? What is this? Okay. As I witnessed my son being devoured by this loathsome creature, my sole focus became seeking vengeance. I am determined to find a way to annihilate this abomination once and for all. This creature known as the Manticore, a detestable man-eater. I'm guessing this is Jahander, the one from the demo that we didn't get to see in the demo. A formidable hybrid form 
with a lion's body, a human head, and the scorpion tail capable of shooting deadly venomous darts, it doesn't satisfy its hunger with just one human kill. It relentlessly pursues multiple villagers, reveling in its bloodthirsty hunt. I must discover a method to eliminate it before it claims more lives around their village. Well, humans are undeniably the manticore's preferred meat. <laughs> it also regularly preys on our livestock, leaving us in poverty. Ah, in poverty? Yeah. In famished. How can we survive if we continue to slay us and consume the very sustenance we require to live? The manticore is believed to be indestructible, but I am compelled to find a way to determine its existence once and for all. I must accomplish this for the sake of my son, to grant him eternal rest. I am tired of hiding. We must stand up and fight tomorrow. Oh, tomorrow I will assemble a group of fierce hunters, and together we will endeavor to bring an end to the relentless rampage that, it, that this creature inflicts upon our land. To my cherished son, I shall do everything in my power to avenge your spirit. I wonder what kid died. Who was it that died? Here we go, finally moving towards our first boss battle. Yeah, that's the one that, te that they teased in the... Uh, they teased it in the in the demo. And then just they they have the end of the demo right there. Oh shit. That was close. Okay, we're going this way. Oh shit! Crap, okay, hold on. Man, the combat's so good. Woo! Oh, shit. Okay. Hold on. Okay. I got this. That attack is a little bit, um... It's a little bit tricky. I like it. So, do you end up playing the... Playing all the pop, oh, Prince of Persia games since the demo. No, I didn't have time to like to even start them, to start start them. Um, so I'm thinking of doing that after this one. God damn it! Okay. Oh my god, dude. You can parry indefinitely your own boomerang attacks. No. What do you mean? No. Yo. Okay. That's a cool ass mechanic. Okay, we're doing that. Thank you for like. Thank you for letting me know, because I don't think the game would have told me that little... Yo! <laughs> okay. This game is... Okay, so far... Okay, so far, this is my game of the year. I know the year you started, but... Holy crap, dude. Okay, hold on. Let me do, let me do it. God, I can't do it now. <laughs> Let's go.
damn, that is fun. Okay. Actually, uh, game told you, but you have to find the art van who's above the lady you bought stuff from. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Platforming when done good in these uh, action games had a lot of experience. I know. It's just it's just another layer, man. Imagine you could do that with your axe. Can oh, dude. Come on. Come on. Yeah. I wish you could do that shit. Just the OP stuff. <laughs> I just got a mobile ad for a girl twerking, and then a zombie breaks in and eats her. What even is YouTube? I, I'm is that one of like one of those like mobile games? That, yeah, I'm, I'm guessing that's what it is, right? One of those fake ass mobile games. Okay, all right. I gotta focus here. I'm getting too giddy with all of these mechanics and shit. Hold on. Let's do it. Thought I parried it, come on. Shit. I can't do it now. Oh my god. I can't blame the game. It's my fault. I know all of these things already. Attack R2, I think it's on PS5. No, R2 is to dodge. Oh my god, he still got me. What is wrong with me? What is wrong with me? Why do I keep dying here? I'm gonna have to start using the... Uh, the Ashra magic things, like the the cooldown, not the cooldowns, the one. The I know what I'm talking about. Heal, damn it, heal. Oh, you fucker. I'm just gonna kill him like this. I'm not gonna risk it. This guy just keeps killing me. There we go. Woo! Okay. Hold on. This ability is actually really useful for these guys because their shields are really annoying. Die already, dude! 
That was a bit risky. N no, while attacking enemy press. Wait, while attacking enemy press. Attack? Attack R2? Oh, I see. That one? No, that can't be it. Attack, attack, R2. No, I think that's it. I think, okay, I think it's just like after one, like, after one dodge, like simple dodge back, like he does that, like just a little thing. That's pretty useful. Thank you for letting me know. Anyone know something? Want to know something? Just want to take a massive bite out of a... Oh, sometimes you just want to take a massive bite? No, Luke. I think that's just you, buddy. Hey, another... Yeah, another one. Okay, good. Maybe I can carry this one now. Okay, I think we're good here. Anything else down there? No. I don't like that move, man, because it gets you on both sides. Like when he does, once he does it, it's like you can get hit on the front or on the back when you finish dodging. So you have to dodge all the way, like, like really far to make sure he doesn't get you. See? Oh, it brings him closer. That is that is a drawback, which is pretty cool. Ah, nice. Step right up. Oh, I don't have any more. The other way can still get me. They break their shield, strike spinning attack. Wait, to break the spinning. Oh! This one? I'll try it. Thank you for letting me know. No, you don't. I need some health, people. I don't think I can still get this one, right? Uh, the velocity of boomerang increases them. Exponentially, so you have to parry it quicker. Ah, that's nice. Okay. Yeah, there's a bit of a drawback. It's that's smart, smart game design. So it doesn't become OP, of course. Oh, thank God. Let's see. Hey, she's here. Sargon of the Immortals. Faraba, were you here waiting for me? The world does not revolve around you, young man. That's my maman Bozog. I just know you'll want to visit her shop from time to time. Hi, Sargon. Buy a hint. A hint of what? I, I just want to see like what the hint is going to be. The upper citadel. Do you know how to get there? Of course I do. I can go anywhere. But for you, <laughs> it might not be as straightforward. Anyway, I see you now have a bow. To the west, you could reconstruct the statue of the great goddess. That's the easiest way. The broken statue. I know where it is. Where? Broken statue. It's here, right? Yeah, this thing. Is where the main thing is. Hey, Monique. Welcome, man. Thank you so much. Um, 
Artaban is a buffer, so you want to have all lessons about combat. You can head towards him. Wait, who, who, Artaban is above who? Like this girl? Welcome. Let's see. Me? Let me get one of these. Do I have a full? I feel like I should buy one more. Oh, wait, wait, wait hold on, hold on. Xerxes. Oh, upgrades, okay. Oh, yeah! No! I don't have enough! Wait, I can do this one. It's a little wavy thing. <laughs> okay, I think I'm good for now. It's not like I can afford it. What is that up here? What is this? Oh, fast travel. Hey, Kahiba's up here. Oh! Oh, okay, it was a door. Okay, let me remove it then. Yeah, let's go in. Now, I know that Kahiba or Kabef, I think is how it's pronounced in Persian. It's a guy in the mythology and he, he wasn't a god or anything. He's just a guy who helped the king... Well, he helped usurp an evil king. The one with the snakes, I'm pretty sure. The one I mentioned earlier. Here's a mortal. One who searches for something out of reach. Beyond control. Who do you serve, I wonder? You know about me. I turn my eye to the human world when I choose. I'm Sargon. I serve Persia as one of the immortals. Immortals, you say? Hmm. Interesting. Well, immortal. You stand before a true immortal. Kahiba. Goddess and blacksmith to the gods. I've forged their greatest weapons. Have you forged weapons for mortals? I've served mortals from time to time. King Darius' sword was some of my finest work. Few other mortals are worthy. I had no idea that in Mount Karth, gods and goddesses walked among humans. It was so. The curse altered everything. Some gods disappeared into other strands of mm. destiny. But I remain. I'm one of the lucky ones. My forge protected me from the winds of time. Either way. Nothing feels the same now. So this is pretty much like Mount Olympus. This is where all the gods lived in Persian mythology. I don't think this is the case in actual Persian mythology. This might be a liberty. But it's an interesting take. Would you forge for a mortal again? For a few time crystals? We might come to an agreement. Understand this. Even in the skewed reach of time, a mortal's life is insignificant. You don't have to be so mean. Welcome. Do you wish something forged? Ancient power on Earth. I doubt a mortal has seen such a forge as mine. I have not. But my blades, Kais and Layla, have never failed me. Oh, he named the blades! Kais and Layla. Okay, I remember that. Flame and heat. This forge channels my Athra. Such an energy is what shapes the strongest of weapons. Believe me, mortal. When I say the forge speaks to me, my forge senses the glow of Athra within everything. It tells me of an awe with ancient power that calls out. Will you find it? Yeah, sure, why not? Yeah. During the shattering, things were lost, while others were unearthed. We shall see if such power wants to be found by a mortal. If you are worthy, then perhaps your map will aid you. Oh. Oh, okay, we're getting some... Si oh, man, I, I, I don't like the fact that... I mean, it's fine. But it's becoming a little bit too icony, you know, for me, for my liking. So that's, that's a little side mission we got there. Now, where... Okay, this is where we have to go. That, it's so cool that at least it tells me. Wait, let's see if we can make some weapons. Wow. The arrowhead. Slightly increased damage of arrows. Mount. I don't have money, though. Uh, 
Oh! Ah, almost. The bow. Bow of Menelias. Okay, there's definitely a lot of... Oh, it's cool. You can even upgrade the pendants, the, the amulets. That's really cool, man. Hey. What do we got there? What is that there? Okay. He also gives you an amulet for finishing uh, training. What are we talking about? Who gives you an amulet? Oh, you retracted it. You retracted it, you du Dooku Gamer. How dare you? Nah, it's all good. All right, let's see. How do I get to the fast travel thing? How does that work? Can I just go up there? It's up there, I think. Like the circle thing? Well, oh, we'll figure out. It seems enemy's health is a little high on this difficulty. You can adjust it to your liking if you want without lowering the overall difficulty. You can do that? That's, I don't know, that's too much customization. Personally, I think. I don't know, like, if, if this is the difficulty they made, like, I'm gonna stick with this one. Unless it becomes a little bit too hard. <laughs> okay, I haven't been here. Oh, there he is. Artsaban. Sargon. Varun saw Anahita's guards, and he's in pursuit. As for me, I cannot continue. My mind is playing tricks on me. I can't discern the truth from the imaginary. Artaban, thank you for being honest with me. Does this mean you're retreating? I'm not giving in just yet. I intend to serve until my last breath. After all, if Anahita really has changed loyalties, I believe you're short of a sparring partner. Oh, okay. Launchers are unique attacks, able to lift enemies. So he, you guys said that he gives me something after finishing this thing? I don't want to do all this. Let's see. Yeah, he gives me rewards. Okay. Artaban, I want to perfect my parrying technique. What do you have for me? The art of parrying requires perfect timing and faced head on. Ah, shit. Okay. Two. Three. Is that all? Get ready to parry. As you may have discovered, projectiles can... I mean, I know how to do... Damn it. Do be vigilant. Once more, not all projectiles can be parried. Some moves give you better opportunities to counter. Learn to identify them and don't miss. Wait. Oh, yeah, okay. Do it. Okay, this I know. They want, they wanted to retract it was the same message. Yeah, it's all good. Don't worry. I was just kidding. Hey, Sasha. What you want, baby? You get needy. Few enemies are able to recover from your rush of our counters. Actually, I named them downburst counters. Whatever you say. Are we done? I wish I could parry any attack. You know that's impossible. Even for me. Fortunately, your senses are sharp. You'll know in advance if an attack can be parried or not. Debatable. Oh, try to parry one, right? This isn't the whole day's lesson, right? There is a lesson in every failure. Did you see the effect of the hit you took? That's what you get when you miss a parry. And pay for it. Health? Being <laughs> hit this way is particularly dangerous. And your Athra focus takes a hit too. Well, I can feel it in my jaw now. <laughs> okay, we're done. We got we have fifty bucks. Um There's some more stuff to like learn, but Let me let me check this one out real quick. After this I'm gonna go and do the boss fight because uh, I have now to go soon. For a specialty of yours. 
Acrobatic techniques. Ready for I'm always ready. You know about mid-air combinations. But there are other options. Try to reach the flying enemy. <laughs> That I knew. Marathon continue tomorrow? Nah, probably not. I'm gonna be playing this. Easy enough. You cannot chain attacks after this move, but it should prove itself useful. Alternatively, you can aim at enemies directly below you. Mind your position. Okay, this I Now that's a new way to lift up the You can send the enemy up even higher with aerial combinations rather than sending them far away. Oh, nice. Okay. Nice. Okay, so 2-2 two, two, and then up square. Okay, nice. Wait, hold on. Oh, wait. Oh, I see. Okay, hold on. Oh, I see. That's what it was trying to tell me. Nice. Okay. This technique is valuable. You can save on time or throw your foe towards environmental hazards. Should you see a use for it, you can also send them crashing into the ground if you prefer. Oh, sweet. Okay. Okay, no, maybe maybe this tutorial is needed, okay? Okay, I messed that one up. I keep <laughs> I keep doing the other one. There we go. If I rush to the ground afterwards, I can maintain my flow before they get back on their feet. <laughs> For that, you know more than I do. I'm past the age to perform cartwheels at the fair. <laughs> Done. Okay. I'm I'm going to keep that I'm going to that's all I'm going to do for now. I'm going to go and head to the boss fight, which I'm guessing that's what it is, but we'll see. We'll see. Marathon continues to work. I read that already. No, I'm going to take a break from the Ragnarok Marathon thing. <laughs> Look, guys, Ragnarok is not a bad game. It's just, it's not very fun to replay, man. Like, I'm not looking forward to it, right? And now with this game that, whew, holy crap, man, this game... Seems to be taking the Metroidvania genre by storm. I love it so far. It's platforming and it's combat. It's a delicious game. Wait. Okay, see, the bird keeps going to these things. What is it? I have no idea what that is. For a good grilled cheese right now. I haven't had grilled cheese sandwiches in a while. I don't know. I just don't like it as much. And I love cheese and bread. Maybe it's fine. Oh, I see the... Oh, no. Never mind. That's not a thing. Okay. I thought that was what I had to do with um, where Orad was before. I'm going to keep it short. Is it good? The game? So far, I really like it. Look at this statue. Look at those statues. Mythological environment speaking, amazing. Okay, combat? Beautiful hack and slash, okay? And platforming so far, even though it hasn't gotten super complex, it's fun, okay? It's just... Overall, it's a really good game so far. Hey, Freeba. Buy map. What do you guys think? Should I buy it? Hello, young warrior. Hello. I've discovered Hello there. 
time crystals will help me share with you. What are these time crystals? The magic around them is older than Mount Kaf itself. When time shattered, we were all trapped, and our magic was trapped within the crystals. It was somehow altered by the chaos of time, so we've had to learn it all over again. Mm. The underwater section. So I'm actually done with the ironwood section. And well, his grandma's a way better cook than their mom. I feel like my mom learned a lot from my grandma and kind of superseded her skills. Lower city. I guess we'll buy it. Eye of the Wanderer. I'll add the information I've gleaned about this area. Nice. Oh, okay. Oh, so this is where we have to go. That's cool. That's cool. That's such a good mechanic. And we have to go there later. Could have bought gives you a path. Hmm. Stand where the bird was and shoot an arrow upwards. Okay, thank you. Okay, we're going. We're going to do that little secret real quick, okay? Because they definitely do seem like... Like a secret, but just didn't know what it was. Is it here? Hey, I haven't been here yet. Okay, hold on. We'll, we'll visit that later. Well, I'll visit that later. Where's the burb? Where was the secret? I lost it. I lost the secret. Just keeps chirping, man. It's here, right? Yeah, okay. Slow down time while aiming with the chakra. Ah, okay. I don't have it yet. Where's the nearest tree? Okay, it's right there. Let me go check it out. Because I, th I also think I have another spot. I just think I have another spot for the... Um, for the amulets, right? Let me check. Okay, slow down time while aiming the chakra at drawing. That's interesting. Ah, but I don't have any. Okay, I see. Well, I'm, I gotta have to be careful with that then. That one might not be very good at the end. Like, it sounds cool at first, but I'm like, yeah, I don't know if I'll like it. Another, uh, sorry, Astrian God. Okay. I'm gonna yeah I'm gonna have to learn a lot more about uh, Persian mythology I man I I don't know any of these gods what is he what is he the god of like what, can you tell me you know do my homework for me <laughs> woo okay I've been here okay we're going we're going we're going now don't worry. Oh, I read this one. This is Jah Jahandria, yeah. uh, with the body of a lion of his man. Those who venture into the Hikir forest and cross his path would disappear forever. To satisfy his appetite, Jahandria once walked through the gates of the citadel, spreading terror for three days. Five hundred warriors were tasked with confronting him. To confront him, none survived. Darius was still a young king. Oh, okay, so this one, when Darius was a king, we're gonna fight him, boys. We're about to fight Jahandria. You guys ready? Getting giddy. I'll probably end it after this fight. 
I'm ready. My body's ready. You know what? I have to pee. Give me a sec. <laughs> Ow, my leg. Let's see. Oh, Sorbin is a god of fate. Oh, okay. Good to know. Don't mess with the mess up the parry. The follow up sequences after it. Wait. Don't mess up the parry. The follow up sequence after it's too good. Okay, okay. I'll try not to, but I, I don't promise anything. Oh, hey, Charlotte, you're going up now. Now while I'm fighting a boss, really. Charlotte, stop. She, my cat just chose the worst time to let go up here. I know you just want pit pits, okay? I know, but I, I gotta fight your kind. Or, you know, lion body. I, you guys see this, right? She's just showing me her butt now. Hold on. I sent where to find the guide, but YouTube doesn't allow me to send it. It will send on Discord or Twitter. Yeah, just send it on Twitter, I guess. Uh, I wonder why YouTube... I guess you sent a video, and the link is not allowed. Okay, let's go. Heard that one before. Charlotte, I can't see. Charlotte, Char I can't see, baby. I can't see. Can you move? Like, she's covering half of the screen. For those of you who have cats, this is what it's like. Charlotte. I mean, for those of you who don't have cats, you're going to have to get down, baby. Come on. She also peed on my bed earlier. <sighs> okay. Sorry, Astrum is actually the oldest remaining religion in Iran. Yeah, I heard that it's still going on but of course it's like not a lot of people i think i'm pretty sure iran is a muslim country right now right okay this guy is difficult Ooh! Ooh! oh fuck what a waste nice What is that? Oh, I see. I gotta break it. Shit. Okay.
Damn. <laughs> okay. I actually did pretty good for like the being the first fight with him. That was just beginner's luck. Why can't I do the square uh, Ashra thing? Oh, it's okay. Cool down. Okay. Oh shit! Okay, new move, new move, okay. Oh shit! Okay, he's got... finish the game this game this stream i hope i can catch the stream in an hour <laughs> uh, i'm probably gonna stop playing after i finish uh fighting this guy uh because i got i got other stuff to do. hopefully i can get started on the sith cosplay thing um servant is infinite time okay drink the potion i had no potion this guy was also in the demo he was he was like the end thing like you didn't actually fight him I thought I did it. Come on, man. I got this. I can do it. It was just beginner's luck, man.
Okay, come on, man. It's getting kind of old. Damn it! <laughs> so I get the fucking orb thing he releases. The moment I did it, the moment I did it, I, I messed it up. the one boys yeah I got it <laughs> Jesus man Oh no, what a waste. No, 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 no. Got him. Oh, <laughs> that was close. Oh shit, no, 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 no. I was so close. So close. Took me six strides. Okay, I can do it. I can, I swear to God.
That fuck. Okay. The OSTs, the, yeah, the soundtrack is pretty good too. I landed on the poison. Well, it's definitely taking... Yeah, don't use arrows before. I'm realizing that I'm using way too many arrows, thinking that I'm going to do a lot of damage. But the arrows are more like... It's similar to God of War, just to keep the enemies in, in the air. Oh, I, I used... It's just... It's just... It's force of habit. I'm gonna have to start pairing that little swipe he does. I think I got him. Please kill him. I don't think it's gonna kill him. <laughs> ah, fucking shit! <laughs> okay. It's that other sweep attack, man. I don't like to use the arrows in that thing, but I guess it makes more sense than just shooting and shooting him with the arrows. 
Ahí. I messed it up. Man, these fights are hard. In a good way. I'm still enjoying it, though. Parry the claw swipe. I know. I know. It's just... I always do it too soon. Break, damn it. Okay, help, help. How am I almost dead? Getting so close, man. Don't stand on the green venom. No, I know, I know. I just I keep messing it up. Shit. Oh! 
Oh shit, I actually did it. I thought I messed it up. No. No. Give me that health. Let's go! Oh! Let's go, I got the hang of it. I finally got the hang of it. Oh no, oh no, 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 no. Cheese it. You gotta cheese it now. <laughs> Shit! Woo! Dude, if they would have given me a quick time event there, I mean, it it's already, I fucking love this game. I, can see, oh, hey, Golden Ink, remember for 36 months, I can't even count how many years it's been, man. Thank you so much. 36 months is crazy. Well done, but thank you. I appreciate it, man. It couldn't be done with this, without the support of you guys, okay? You guys are awesome. Uh, Doku Gamer just became a new member. You've been a member for 36 months. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much. But this game, man, oh, I've... I found it, like, th this is probably my game of the year, okay? I don't know what other big games are coming out this year, but man, this one's, this one's scratching me right where I itch, like, it's just, it's got everything, dude, like, even though it's a Metroid Mania, I don't get lost, I just don't, because look, that's where I have to go next, I love it, okay? Exploration is fine, so long as it's not forced on me, right? It's, it's the first Metroid Mania. is this game better than Symphony of the Night? I don't know if it's better, but I think it's... I prefer more over it. Holy shit, man. It's so fun. The combat's also awesome. It's just... It's really good. It's... Good job, Ubisoft. Or who, who developed it? Ubisoft pu published it, right? But who developed it? Congrats to the team who uh, worked on this. This is awesome, man. I love it, okay? Fucking love it. All right. Get effing parried, man. It was just... Woo! I love... I love me a good parry mechanic. I do. Sekiro is one of my favorite games of all time, and this game is giving me that feeling as well. Like, you guys saw it. Like, I only, I didn't have any health. 
And it was just like, yeah, I had to get it right. Oh, man, I love it. You really, yeah, it really scratches the platforming ick. It does, man. It does. Where are you itching? I'm not going to tell you that. Don't get dirty on me. Uh, Ubisoft Montpellier. I can't pronounce that, but yeah. You can turn off the... You can turn off guided if you want. No! No! And I mean, that's awesome that... For people who prefer to just get lost in these things, that's awesome, but... That was always my main issue with Metroidvania games. I hated them because I'm like, dude, I just want to, like, explore... I just want to experience the game and... In Dread or in Symphony of the Night or even Hollow Knight, games that I like. Like, I would just get lost and just lose interest. Like, I don't know where to go next. I hated watching tutorials to, like, find out where I had to go next. This, this is where it's at. I love this. Now, I gotta... Jahander is not really a god in Persian mythology, is he? I don't think he is, right? It won't show you where you need to be. Wait, what? Now I want to get this game. Get it! It's worth it. It's actually quite cheap. I mean, I mean, it's cheaper than your usual um, AAA game. I think I bought the deluxe edition, which was like normal price. I, I won't tell me now because I purchased it. But I think, don't quote me on this, but I think just a regular game, it's 50 Canadian dollars. The deluxe one was 79. So that's what I mean. 79 for the deluxe edition is pretty good. I like it. Oh, there's a Tekken 8 demo. I didn't know there was one. Yeah. Anyway. I'm going to stop for a bit now. Uh, I'll probably play some more of this tomorrow. Uh, I'm not going to tell you that I'm not going to play until tomorrow. I'm probably going to play a little bit more because I just, I like it so much. Um, Sunday, which is tomorrow, I was hoping to upload a, my theory video on the collector mystery thing. I got done with the script like on Thursday or Friday, but I didn't want to rush uh, editing it. So... And I think it's better also to keep it for next week. That way I can just get on schedule and making videos ahead of time. Like, I'm always rushing to get, like, the video done on Sunday. I'm not very good with time management. But tomorrow I have, like, a, a reaction to a God of War video that I had never seen. And it's like, it's... I'll let you guys... I'll let you guys see it. Okay, it doesn't matter. Um, I got it from Epic Store, which is $30. Oh, I don't know that. That's pretty good, man. Go save before... Wait, you have to save? What do you mean, save? It saves automatically, right? I don't have to do anything, right? Let me see what's on the other side. Oh, cutscene. Oh! Oh shit, what's going on? One of the Simorg's feathers? Bend space and move through the air by pressing R2. Finally, okay. You can also be used to use of being hit to stop. Wait, you can you can also be used after being hit to stop a fall before reaching the ground. Oh, so you don't lose time getting up. That's that's so cool. Like the game tells you, okay, you got this new ability, you can go here now. Okay, I don't really, I'll keep it there, but I don't really need it right now. That's so cool. Okay, it's getting good. It's getting good. But I gotta go. I uh, Adult life calls me, and I have to probably do the cosplay thing with my wife. Go ahead and interact with the tree. What do you mean? What ha What's gonna happen? What do you mean, interact with what? Ooh. Love it. What is that there? Is that where I got the feather? What symbol is that? No idea what that is. Oh, hey, Artovan. Sign of the prince. None. And I've been scouring the place for three days now. Three days? Artovan. But we only got here hours ago. Hours for you. Days for me, years for Ardashir's man.
Okay, that's the tree. What happens with it? Okay. I'll probably go later on to, um... To Kahiba. See if I can uh, level up some things. But... That's a respawn point. Oh, I see what you're saying. My, like, my safe point. Yeah, okay, that, that's fair, yeah. I did it, right? Yeah, I did. Just making sure again. This is really for saving, but I don't think you need to do it. That's what I, mean. I think there is, there is like, a save function to it. I see now the little tree symbol thing. I think it's fine if you don't do it. It's a modern game. Yeah, exactly. Anyway, you guys have been awesome. Man, my hair is really greasy. Ugh! You guys have been awesome. Thank you so much for being here. I might play some of this tomorrow just because I want to play some. And it seems like there's a good chunk of you who want to see me play it too. There's 50 people. Oh, no, 33. It's still 33 people. That's pretty good for a non God of War livestream. That's, that's a pretty good number. Uh, so, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. And uh, I'll see you guys maybe tomorrow. Until then, remember, go forth in the name of Valhalla. Do do do.